friends! Welcome back to our channel if you've seen our videos before, and if you're new, welcome in! My name's Hope. My name is Abby. And we're the, the Disney, Disney Sisters. Today we have some pins to open with you, some Disney princess pins, which we haven't done in a while. Ever. I've been missing the princess pins specifically. Yes. Um, so we have a couple of, I believe these are from Loungefly or Box Lunch. I love One of the, two. the recycled looking boxes. I know, they're made of recycled materials. Very cool. So those are right there. We got these boxes from our mom, so shout out to you mom, thank you for giving us special surprise boxes to open yeah. because these kind of coordinate weirdly with our advent calendars this year which I they think is really do. fun. My advent calendar this year is book themed so it's like bookmarks and washi tape and various little stickers and things about bookish stuff. Yep. And in true five-year-old style my advent calendar is all candy so <laughs> I get a candy to eat every it's day. It's a nice little candy sampler. It is. It has calendar. like a ton of different mystery candies. Do you have a favorite so far? Um, probably the gummies from day seven. Mm -hmm. They were like a one of those like powdered hard oh. gummies. So they aren't like sugar coated. It's just like a matte coating. Mm. And then it's like it ends on a sweet note. It's nice. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Anyway, so we I have to show you, but I ate them. <laughs> two boxes each of these two different series that we are going to be opening together in this video, and I am pretty excited. So yeah, here is what the front of my box looks like. This is the Disney Princess Lounge Fly Collection for ages six and up, and there are I think it's only one pin per box. So here is what the back of the box looks like. There are six pins in this collection and each one is themed on a different princess. We have Sugar Spun Strawberry, which is Sleeping Beauty, Darling Dragon Fruit, which is Mulan. We have Courageous Coconut, which is Moana, I think. We have Spirited Splashing Starfruit, which is Ariel. And then we have Bippity Boppity Blueberry, which is uh, Cinderella. Ambitious Ambrosia Maple, which is Tiana. Wow. Those are hard to say. Obviously, we know which one I'm hoping for. It's this little one down here. That, I that's love the one. It. Bibbity bobbity blueberry. What a fun I'm just going to call all blueberry candy. from now on. This is my pin box. Aren't these so cute? Look, they're little book covers with princesses on them and matching little bookmarks for each one. I think they are so cute. They've got little sidekicks on the bookmarks. Adorable. So we've got Aurora and the little owl. We've got um, Ariel and Flounder, Belle and Lumiere, Cinderella and Gus Gus, Jasmine and Raja, and Rapunzel and Pascal. I'm so excited to open these and these come with two mystery pins it says, two surprise pins. So I'm gonna assume it's like a book and a bookmark. Probably. But I don't know if they're necessarily gonna That'd go be together. Cool, though. We'll find out. So find out if we get a matching set. So yeah, I was correct. So there's this one feels like the book cover and then this one feels like the little bookmark. What a fun idea for us. It's so fun. Set. I'm gonna start with the bookmark just because I think. Oh. Alright. I feel like changing it up. I said so we're gonna see the if they relate to each other. Yeah, I don't know if they're gonna match or if history. they're gonna be random, but let's random. Find out. Cute. Okay. Okay. All right. It's the owl from Sleeping Beauty. So let's see if the book cover is Aurora. But look how cute I this is. I love that it's got the little ribbon tassel at the top. This is so cute. All right. Let's see if it's Aurora. Is there some strategy here, or is this completely like a draw? Let's see. There is! At least in this box, there that is a little strategy. Yes. So this is the Sleeping Beauty pin, oh. and it's got the recycling logo on the back. I think it's because these, it says on the front, this product contains a minimum of 25% recycled metal. This box is made of recycled materials. Metal is one of our most precious resources because it can, will never be depleted. It can be recycled, remelted, and reshaped into new products countless times. That's true, but look how pretty this is. So this is the Sleeping Beauty one. I actually love this. It looks like like a proper storybook, yeah, like a child storybook. Are perfect, that like fantasy. Colors. That is so pretty. I love the castle in the background. And then here's what the back looks like. Like I said, it's got the recycling logo over and over again, which is kind of fun to show that this pin series was made with recycled materials. So I've got Aurora and her little owl friend. His name is Owl. His name is Owl. Not related to the owl from the 100 Acre No Wood. different owl. <laughs> Completely unrelated. Ow! Look at it. It totally tore my 
The Get box there. bit you. <gasps> the nerve. This non-recycled material is way sharp. <laughs> it's just like, you should have recycled. <laughs> I do recycle fin box. I do. So the ones I would love to see would be Cinderella, obviously. I think the Tiana looks really cool, and then maybe the Sleeping Beauty. Okay. We're hoping for Cinderella. My really tough, hard plastic slime bag. We're pulling for Cinderella. Bibbidi bobbidi booberry. Here we go. Booberry. 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 <laughs> wrong. Wrong season. Happy Halloween. <laughs> oh, they're tiny. Okay, ready. Okay, All it's right. Courageous Coconut, which is Moana. They are quite small, and yeah. they are a soft enamel, which most of the Lounge, lounge Fly pins are. are yeah. um, and then this one, they did the half print on the back as well, but it's ca it's tiaras instead of recycling yeah. logos. It's really cool. I love the colors. It's yeah, quite fun. Yeah, and, you and do of like course, I do. I love coconut stuff. candies, so this is great. It is a little bit small. I don't know yeah. if you can tell size-wise. And then here is what the back looks like. It doesn't have the Mickey backing because it is a lounge fly pin. And it has like the little princess uh, crowns on the top. It does have a little bit of inset uh, glitter on the inside, which is yeah, really cute. Yeah, I love that on the middle. Yeah. I like the detail of the design. Cute. Okay. All right. Let's see who else we're going to get. I hope it's somebody different because that would be really, really sad. Okay. We're not going to think that way. I'm going to start with the book Go this time. for Belle. Go for Rapunzel. Go for Belle. Oh, you're starting with the book you said? Yeah, I'm going to start with the book this time. I'm going big. I'm going big. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> it's another Sleeping Beauty. I almost wish I'd gotten double Cinderella because then I could have given you. I know. But no. <laughs> I had to get double Sleeping Beauty. I love Sleeping Beauty. I it's do fine. think it's super interesting, which I don't know if you noticed, if you mentioned this or not, but she's in her blue dress. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Because the backing is pink, I'm assuming they chose to put her in a blue dress. And I love but that. unusual to find her in her blue dress and pins. Yeah, that's true. I'm going to assume, yeah, this is the little owl friend. Ah, uh, what a bummer. Oh, well. It's still really cute. And I do like that she's in the blue dress. That's a good point that I hadn't noticed because, yeah, makes it more unique, more rare. Yeah. That might actually be a really good trader because some people yeah. look for her just in her blue dress. That's true. Okay, pin number two. Last one of this opening. Let's see. Cinderella. 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 Like a sugar pack. Cinderella. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to keep chanting. Ooh, that was a really through. nice, really nice pull. Here we go. What is it, guys? No, we are a very Sleeping Beauty theme. Is that a truck backing it's up? It's the FedEx truck. All right, well, we He's have to keep going because now I'm like, it totally ruined the surprise. How dare you, sir? So this is the Sleeping Beauty themed candy. I think that's it really says cute. sugar spun strawberry. Look how much glitter is the on the glitter. inside. The glitter. This is actually a very cute pin. I love it. I love the design of it. I love the gorgeous. details. Let me show you guys. Look how cute and bubblegum pink it is. Sugar sponge strawberry. You can see there is like a, a glitter inlay on the inside. You have the spinning wheel and the pink on the outside as well. I do really like the design of these pins. I think these are really cute. I would love to get the whole set um, and just put them on a pin board, maybe yeah. as like a candy banner at the bottom. I don't that know. That would be so cute. Right? Like, can you see these just like lined up together yeah, on the bottom of absolutely. a pin board? Yeah, super cute. But yeah, look at us in our matching you know, themes. <laughs> Talk about today. theming. Do we need to watch Sleeping Beauty today or something? Maybe this like, is I feel sign. like it's a sign that we, we need should. to watch it again. We should. I do love that movie, so I wouldn't be mad. It's a very good movie. Right. Um, and we're here for classic princess movies. All, like, all day. Honestly, long. I'm just so. here for Aurora rep because I feel like she often gets cut from princess stuff. Yeah. So I'm, I'm here think for she's it. She's like the most boring. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It's like probably that people don't. Everyone could just calls her Sleeping Beauty and don't. They don't even know her, her name. name, and she has is... so many names. You have so many options. Of what yeah, you that's call true. Her, and yet they still say Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> she's got like seven names. It's not like it's hard. <laughs> Pick your favorite. <laughs> but one thing that we do want to say before we wrap oh, up yes. this video is a, an exciting announcement that we have to share. But first, followed up by a thank you. We wanted to thank you guys so much to everybody who joined us for our Disney Christmas party on Whatnot last week. It was such so a fun. blast. We had so much fun. And thank you guys, everybody who came and supported, who showed up, who chatted with us in the comments, and who purchased things. We really, really appreciate you guys. We would not be here without all of you. To follow up with that, we have another announcement, and that is we're doing another Whatnot Live. Another one live. Mm -hmm. And if you're here because you like pins, you'll be interested in hearing about this one. In theme to go with Pin Miss that we are doing on Vlogmas this yes. year, it is going to be an entirely pin live. Pins 
pins Only. out the wazoo we and have they're so all much to share going to be amazing we have some limited editions we have some open editions we have some mystery box pins we're gonna have different price ranges so there's something for everybody and basically in the spirit of pin miss we wanted to be able to share some pins with you guys these are all gonna be available on Wednesday December 13th at 11 45 a.m. we're going live again we're going live again so if you going want to come live up with again. us again <laughs> And we are switching up the time a little bit and the day, just trying something new. Let us know in a comment down below if you would like to participate in the lives, um, what time works best for you. Yeah. We were kind of thinking maybe around lunchtime, you could go on your lunch break at work or maybe while you're in the pickup line, um, you can be on the live buying some pins, <laughs> hanging out with us. But um, let us know, is weekend better, weekdays, is lunch better or evenings? Let us know. Um, we're just kind of trying out a bunch of things to see what works best for you guys mm -hmm. and uh, what we like as well. Yeah. And the mystery is gonna be back. If you know, you know, it's gonna be better than ever. There's some mystery things that I'm really excited. We upped the ante of the mystery. So don't you worry. It's going to be good. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. And if you weren't at the first one on live and you're like, what is, what the heck are you saying? It's a wreath, an advent wreath that has gift with purchase items in it. So if you come to the live, you definitely you get a chance to get a fun extra bonus gift. You get to experience in your the presence. mystery. Yes. <laughs> so we're going to have pins on pins on pins. We would love for you guys to come and hang out with us. If you are new to Whatnot and you missed our first live, I will leave the links down in the description box below. If you're new, you can sign up and get a $10 credit to join Whatnot, and you can use that in the live as well. You can click the link below that link to actually bookmark this show so you don't miss it on Wednesday, December 13th at 11.45. Because I knew that we're talking pins. when it happens. Yes, I'm so excited. Honestly, what could be better? Like, that is so up our alley. We're like just gonna be sitting talking about pins yeah. and lots of Christmas pins, lots of, lots Christmas of pins, pins with characters that we collect, movies that we collect. So, definitely be sure to join us on Wednesday. And I think that's all we have to share with you guys today. So, hopefully, you had fun. I had fun. I love talking pins. It's always fun talking pins, and yep. opening pins is even more fun. So, yep. it's always a good time. So, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscription button down below so you don't miss any future content. We have a lot of it coming between now and Christmas. Yeah, we're doing Vlogmas every day leading up to Christmas. Every day. So you get one content hang out with every us day. Often, come and join us every day. And speaking of that, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye! <laughs> Bye!